Hello, my name is Maria Haddon, and I'm here to talk about what topic I've chosen to study for for my second project. I've decided to look more into about taiko drumming. Like most myths, there are a few different versions, but there is one that continues to pop up that I'm interested in. I would also like to know a little bit more about how taiko is used in a Japanese holiday called Obom, which is similar to the Mexican holiday, the Day of the Dead, or also known as Cinco de Mayo. But instead of it being one day, Obon is a three day long holiday. Now, I would like to show a small clip of some local groups performing during Obom. <laughs> Taiko and Obon has both originated in Japan and has spread through the Ryukyu Islands. I have been working with a local Okinawa group teaching Taiko to Americans, and I was thinking about talking to one of them to get more of an insight about what Taiko is and how it is associated with the holiday Obon. This topic interests me because I have been doing Taiko for many years now. However, I've actually never learned how Taiko was created and why we use it to perform in Obon festivals. Also, I thought it would be nice to learn more about the Okinawa and Japanese culture because Obon is in a couple of weeks. Unfortunately, it will occur after the class ends, but there are plenty of Taiko performers who are performing throughout the week to prepare for one of the most important holidays of the year. This myth is an appropriate topic for this class because creation of Taiko is a myth itself and Taiko has created traditions and are used in rituals throughout Japan and the Ryuka Islands. Thank you for your time and I hope you have all enjoyed this video.